Well, you know where you go. And that is the community center, yes. Hey everybody, welcome back to Bluegrass Farm. Hey, just a quick little note. Thank you so much for all of your recent support. It means a lot to me. We've doubled every metric on the channel, essentially. Views, hours watched, impressions, almost a million in the last 28 days. That is all because you comment, like, share, and all that good stuff that you do on YouTube that has literally nothing to do with me and everything to do with you. So thank you so much for that. Really do appreciate it. Can't say that enough. Thank you as well to the channel members. We are now over 60 channel members, which is up about, uh, I think it's like 25 or 26 since like just before 1.6 came out. So thank you to everybody there as well. Uh, you are all amazing. Let's get into this episode. Here we are back on a bluegrass farm. We are approaching the end of summer. The weather report for tomorrow is beautiful and sunny. The fortune teller today is good humor, which means maybe a trip to the mines. It could be. Uh, also, do we have this already? I guess we do. We can sell those, maybe. We can keep this. We need to keep that. Because we need more... If we ever need more bait... Got a hair. A hair stuck in my mouth. Ugh, it's miserable. Because I was just scratching my head. It's my own fault. You probably didn't need to know all that. More deluxe bait than we can shake a stick at. More crops as well. Okay, let's... Let's get some of this sorted out here. A shed is a luxury that we do not have the ability to utilize at the moment. However... Bug meat is something that we can utilize. Let's go here. We'll drop off the amethyst. Go over here. We'll grab our watering can, which we do need. Go say hello to Tiger the cat. Do a little watering. Go say hello to the animals for today, which means we also need our milking pail. We might as well grab the fishing rod as well. Add some bait to it. And get on with the day. Both of the cows, I believe, are there in the same spot, maybe. I could be wrong. No, I don't. Maybe not. Let's make sure that the cows have some food. We do have enough money to upgrade the barn. Oh, there you are. You snuck off to the north. So that you could enjoy the lovely and tasty grasses. Whack, whack. What do we got over here? We got floppers and we got puddles. Let's go. We also have eggs. Delicious, tasty eggs. Uh, speaking of delicious and tasty, we got to fix this fence. Ugh, the, f the fence fixing never ends. Wait, did we? Oh, we do? Oh, you a large milk. Well, you know where you go. And that is the community center, yes. Okay, uh, let's see how much how much wood do we have? Not as much as one would hope. Uh, here's here's why I say that, because we, we need a whole pile of it in order to be able to, uh, you know, take care of, oops, take care of uh, upgrading anything. And, um... We just don't have it, so... Not, not really sure what we're going to do about that. Um, I do need another chest, though. Put that away. And I guess we'll put the other chest here. What's a good fall color? Maybe purple? We'll make fall purple? Sure, why not? Do we have other things that are fall, like a fall seed, pumpkins? Okay, are you fall? Yes. Are you? Nope, that's summer. Do we get fall seeds? No, I, I guess we want it until we get the foraging thing done, right? Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, well, off we are to begin watering the crops. I will say we are doing exceedingly well with the sprinklers. I, I was concerned initially a little hop backwards there ought to do. Still makes me smile. I was initially concerned that we would not have enough resources to do that, but... Uh, it's looking like it's going well. Uh, we have enough resources that we've been able to just kind of get everything done that I've wanted to get done so far, really. 
there there is one major purchase that I tend to have done by now that we just have not been able to work into the economy. And that purchase, of course, would be the Iridium Fishing Rod, which uh, we still don't have. Currently, to get it would be... Oh, Magnet, you have failed me. Would be half of our income. And uh, that feels like a lot of income. So... I don't know that now is the time. You know what I'm saying? It is the time to get some of these rocks, however. Uh, I do need those. Wait to water stuff still, but I gotta get rid of these. I need more stones. Uh, do these big ones, uh, do these count for uh, experience, by the way? We should probably check the fruit bat cave, too. It's been a while. So, fruit bats. What do you got for us? Okay, we got some salmon berries. Okay, a spice bear. We got an orange. Gus loves oranges. So not not bad. Still no apples. This is a recurring theme in my life. We did get an apple tree, though. Uh, so, you know, rejoice and be glad as far as that is concerned. I did... Okay, so we did put down a tamper there. Perfect. And I can't go through there, which means that's a problem. Okay. You know, we might as well just eat this now. But we do have more work to do in terms of watering. And then what do we do? Do we go mining? Do we go buy a fishing rod? Do we go cut down trees? Because I do need some wood. That is sure. We have to go to the community center as well and drop off this large milk. And we have some crops that we need harvesting. And watering as well. Let's not forget that. Let's get that watered. Get this watered. And get... Um, it's going to be like that, is it? Okay. Well, let's go empty the inventory. So, how's everybody doing today? I hope you're all doing great, friends. Today is a lovely day. Do we have anything in there that's fall? That's spring, sp summer... Okay, I think we can just sort of, like, run through and quick stack a bunch of things. Uh, I don't know that we have any salmon berries stored up, actually. Let's keep a couple on hand just in case, you know, we run into something that needs that. Very nice. Oh, we just thought this yam. I, you know, we're gonna... I, I don't... We don't need it for the community center, but I'm gonna hold on to it because... It is possible, I suppose, that it will come in handy... Maybe we'll make a seed out of it, or... Yeah, I don't really know. All right, let's get harvesting. Uh, cow friend, are you searching for food in the wrong place? Michelle, what are you up to down here? You silly cow. This food is not for you. This is uh, hopefully going to become some tasty beverages. Yeah, I agree. Tasty beverages are good, aren't they? Yes, they can be very good. Only when used in moderation and at the appropriate age. Ding! Gotta, gotta put that one in there for, for all the young ones. Actually, I don't think anybody that young watches this channel except my own children. <laughs> Based on the metrics, most of you are between the ages of uh, 18 and 40-something. With the biggest group being uh, in your mid-20s, according to my analytics. Do I know if that's actually true or not? I have no idea. <laughs> that's just just what the, the YouTube information page tells me. I don't often poke through the analytics because, you know, really, I do this to enjoy myself. I do it to make a little bit of extra money on the side so that I can indulge my gaming hobby without... You know, worrying about my real life budgetary concerns too much. Um, you all have afforded me the opportunity to engage in my video gaming habits in all sorts of ways that I never thought I would be able to. So thank you for that. And uh, yeah, it's it's really amazing, actually. 
Like the computer that I have right now that I'm playing this game on was only able to be upgraded uh, a couple years ago because of this channel. I mean, you know, it makes a difference. You know, I, I just say it like, thanks. I, it's things I couldn't do on my own. My computer would be woefully out of date uh, otherwise. I could probably still play Stardew, but I don't think I could play anything like, like newly released. <laughs> Nothing at all. Okay, so I really need to make a decision here. Am I, am I gonna save the money for the, the fall crops? Do we try to get the barn now so that we can work on getting, uh, what's that called? Um, uh, there's a word I'm searching for and not finding. Uh, the, the barn upgrades... Uh, goats! So that we can get goats. Um, ah, boy. That's a tough one. It's a tough one indeed. Alright, let's go look for Sam real fast. I'm hoping that we can give him this lovely purple thing and that he likes it. Do I know if it's... If it Sam likes that, I don't know, but it says any that would delight anyone. So I am assuming that this will work out. Oh, perfect. Hello, friend Sam. Whoa, hold on. Is this for me? I never expected this. Thank you. <gasps> We're at two of eight. There's hope. Oh, hi. It's good to see you again. Oh, we have hope. That didn't even count as a gift. What? All right. Since that's the case, Gus, I need a pizza. Thank you. Sam, Sam, come back. Sam, don't go in your room, Sam. Please don't be in your room. <gasps> Perfect. And a gift. Oh, yeah, pizza time. Oh, we're still at two. One sec, I gotta beat this level. Okay, yeah, no problem. <laughs> oh, we might... We might make it. We just need <laughs> one more pizza. Oh, I hope one more pizza is enough for three hearts. I really want to see that event. Ooh, this could be the request. Ooh, we get to keep the fish. Four chubs. I think we can make four chubs happen. Uh, are you still open, Pierre? No. <laughs> Come back. 10,000. I would like that as well. Okay, we need four chubs, and we have to divest ourselves of some inventory. Where's the best place to get chubs? Maybe we go up to the lake? Perhaps the lake is... where we go. Demetrius, hello. How are you today? Where do I take this lovely... milk? Up here, I suppose. Yes. Okay, duck eggs are on the way, so I just need a large goat milk or a wool. Emily sends me wool in the mail. We should maybe work on becoming really good friends with Emily. And then maybe we could get a wool that way. That would mean we wouldn't have to upgrade the barn, necessarily. It would still be the fastest way, though, probably, to get the item that we need there. Because it would take a while to become good friends with Emily, and then you have to hope that, you know, you get the item you want in the mail. So, hmm. Not, just not sure. But let's sell a couple of things here. Sell some corn. Sell a cheese. Quick stack a bunch of things. Go fishing. Enjoy life. Laugh about our hopes and dreams of having apples. You know, the, the usual. The normal. I really do need more wood, though. But now we have a mission to catch chubs for a ticket, and I would like a ticket. So I suppose if we can get the chubs tonight yet, then tomorrow we can go get a bunch of wood. And that sounds feasible to me. Because I need tappers. I want a bunch of tappers. 
We did just get a bunch of copper. What did we get? 60 or 70 copper the last time we were in the mines? So that's nice. We also got the star drop, which is really nice. Uh, I'm thinking the next star drop that we can get uh, will be the one probably at the fair, right? And then we can get another one hopefully from the secret woods uh, by growing a gem berry. Now that assumes that the gem berry does not get hit by lightning. Unlike our poor tree that had a tapper on it. I'm, I'm really irritated that our tapper tree got smacked by lightning. <laughs> like, why game, why? Aha, there's one. So glad that we have one out of four. 25% of the way done. Here we go with the next one. Nope, that's not a chub. That's a pike. I thought about going to the lake, but it's so far away. Uh, this is just closer. Also, with the deluxe bait, look at how... <laughs> this is really technically fishing level 11 bar size, which is two entire blocks on the fishing bar. It's a... It's a nice... It's a nice size. Two out of four. Was Willie at the saloon today? Is that a place where Willie resides? I would like a chest, thank you. Grab a fish. Grab a chest. Mm, maybe we can get a diamond. No, coal? Okay. I was gonna say, maybe the Neptune's glaive was the first thing I thought, and then I was like, well, we don't really need that anymore. <laughs> At this point, that would be not actually that helpful. Ding! Chub. Nope. Bream. And do I have to take them to Willy, or... Do I just have to catch all four and then just have talked to him? I don't... I'm never sure on this one. I know what the ores you have to take them. Take the ores over to Clint. Take the coal over to Clint. But do we have to take the fish over to Willy? Hmm. I'm just not 100% on that one. Ding! Now, with our funds, we will... This might get us another thousand if we're lucky. So really, that 200 or so from Willy, I mean, you know what? You don't think it's a lot, but it adds up. Every little bit kind of adds up. I've even been selling a lot of my gemstones this run, if you'll notice. And those of you who are veterans of the Hillhelm Gaming channel will know that I tend to hoard, hoard, with a D, all of those beautiful gemstones for gifts. I get them as gifts, usually. Um, that's usually why I have them around. And then by the time, you know, you would just be selling them for for funding you don't need money anymore because you have an entire farm fi uh, you know filled with uh star fruit and stuff like that and it's just irrelevant but in this particular run we certainly do need the extra funding as soon as possible so it's nice to be able to just sell them there we go, that's all four. Let's swing back through town, although I don't anticipate that he's there, but maybe, just maybe. Gotta talk to Willy. You get to keep the fish. Okay, I did catch all four, that's true. I hear there's an item in the game now called the Trash Catalog, by the way, and I... I don't really know what's going on with that, but uh, apparently you have to search enough trash cans and then you just have a chance of finding it. So that's interesting. Uh, nope, no Willy today. All right. Or if there is, he's already back. Wow. A sweet pea in the garbage. That's not... That's not something that I was anticipating. Ooh, it's getting very late, but I want to check this real fast. All right, what do we got coming up? <gasps> Willy's birthday, you say? Oh, you know, since since we're out and we have an inventory slot, I think I'm just going to... Hi, Clint. 
<gasps> no, I should have just grabbed it when we were there. I thought maybe it was 12.30. I say, I was going to say, I'm just going to grab another pizza real fast. To give to Sam and hope that that gets us three hearts. I really, really hope it does. Uh, That would be amazing. Simply amazing if it does. Then we could maybe hopefully see the event that I'm trying to see. Well, we don't need any of those, but we're going to keep... We're going to keep the chubs, because I, again, I'm not sure if we need to, we need to do there. Okay, we need to make, we need to make some copper bars. Now those will not take very long, so we're just going to go to sleep and make more in the morning. Go to sleep, yes. Summertime. Okay, what has spiked our income here? Oh, the corn. That makes sense. All right, not bad, not bad. We made a couple thousand. Slowly inching towards some having some money. And what's on the queen of sauce for today? Baked fish. Need a second chef just to keep that from hopping on the counter for a bite. Make sure it's fresh. We already know how to make it. Yep, I think I thought I remembered reading that one out loud. Good humor spirits again. A weather report for tomorrow again is clear and sunny. Okay. We have a sword. This grass needs to not be growing there. Well, let's just get right into it then, shall we? We got most of our energy back. Which is always nice to see. We'll water these crops real fast and then hopefully... Our copper will all be done. We can make a little bit more copper. And then... Uh, I will say hello to all of the animals. That's the plan. Moo, indeed. Oh, missed one row there. Perfect. And of course the hops are once again ready. We have some tomatoes that are ready. And the peppers are ready as well. The inventory sure fills up pretty quickly these days. Lots of things going on on the farm. Do we have room for everything? I'm not sure. We might actually have to go drop a couple things off and come back. We'll see. Maybe we have enough room? Just barely. If we do, we have it by the exact amount necessary, basically. Yeah, because we need... we got to pick up eggs still. and uh, Yeah, we're just going to have to put some things away before we do that. Oh, Peppers, you are beautiful, and I love you so. This empty spot in this corner makes me sad, but... You know, we did what we could. We did what we could there. Good morning, cow. Good morning, cow. How did this seed get here? What are you doing? That's not okay. Right. Even more copper. Quick stack, put put those away. Let's go over here. We're gonna quick stack these items. I don't know how many tomatoes we need still. I mean, I feel like that's a pretty good amount of tomatoes. We had a lot of peppers. You know, I think we'll just keep the, re the, the gold ones. Although, maybe we keep some just to maybe, if, you know, for crafting just in case we need to craft something. There we go. Okay, we have some lovely, a lovely summer squash for energy today. Come on over here, sell some things. Water for the cat. Grab the milk pail, that's what we need. And I think today what we'll do is we will go and we will try to get some wood down in the the forest below us. Okay, there's one small duck. Hello, other duck. Where? There you are. <laughs> it's so hard to see them in there. You just kind of have to hold down the button and, like, hope that you find them, really. I should make a path, like, right there, but we'll get around to it eventually. Five more copper bars. Now, we don't need to worry about milk for anything, so we can make cheese with it now. We have delivered the large one over to the community center. 
18 copper bars. Very nice. Uh, now we need iron and we need gold. We have a bunch of things to open here. Uh, you know, maybe we do that. Maybe that's a thing that we can do real quick. All right, let's let's you know let's use this container for now. We'll put. put are we gonna go to the mines today? I don't think I am. So let's just put a bunch of things away. Bring the rest of that for encouragement. Grab all of these. Oh, we could. Yes, I think today is the day that we enjoy one of our espresso. Okay, here we go. Now, we need to go see Clint. We need to buy a pizza. We need to see Willie. And we need to go over here as well. Ooh, more copper. And some sweet peas. Not that we really need those, but that's okay. Now, first things first. I think we're going to open the mystery boxes because I have no idea what comes in these. It, like... It could be useful items, or it could not be. I really have no idea what is in these things. Is that a blueberry? It is. We got a blueberry tart. Couple mountain warp totems. Okay. I think we already have the ancient drum. Pretty sure. Interesting that the music fades out completely while you're opening uh, geodes now. Does this... Is this feel a little faster to anybody else? The animations? Maybe they don't. Ooh, an earth crystal. That's nice. Lots of new items right there, I'll tell you that. Oh, a double. We got a double limestone. Okay, let's put this down. Go to the shop and see. Gunther needs, Gunther needs, Gunther needs, Gunther needs. Don't need that. Right then, we will be right back. Let's just run down here to Gunther, drop off some things, and we'll go open some more geodes. Donate to the museum. Orange. You know, let's, you know, let's toss a couple oranges in here. We'll put this down here, because why not? Same thing with this. Uh, let's put it over here, I guess. We'll put you over... Oh, we don't have enough room for everything. We have four there, though. And then I think there's six of those. So we can put that right there. Check here. Collect rewards. What do we have? We have a rare crow. Eight of eight. Very nice. We don't need that. Okay. Okay. What do we do with this blueberry? Uh, was that was that Penny over here? Here, look, I don't need this. There you go. Have a blueberry thing. <laughs> I need I need the inventory space. I was gonna say it's not because I actually like you, but then I felt like that would feel that would feel mean to say, you know. So I did I didn't want to say that, but then I said it anyway. So I guess shame on me, right? I don't think we had the Jamborite. I think that's the second one of those we've gotten today, actually. The Orpiment. Or however you say that. Another Earth Crystal. Very nice. More mayonnaise machines. Always good. Okay. Gunther can tell us more. Gunther can tell... Okay, we don't need that. Back to Gunther. We have three... Three Geos left. More donations. This one's yellow. Exciting. Green over here. We'll put the brown one. I guess we'll put it down here. Now what's our reward? I don't know which one of those is new. Probably one of the pictures. Maybe the vase or the vase, if you want to say it that way. I don't really have a strong uh, opinion, you know? Process the geodes. Boop. And a boop. Aha, iron. And a boop. Ooh, lots of earth, earth crystals. All right, all right. Well, that's lovely. And um, we got some hardwood, which I deeply appreciate. 
Okay, Willie. Let's let's see what we can grab down. Oh boy. We're gonna run out of room, aren't I? Probably. It all depends on the quality of these coral. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Well, those aren't worth anything. Let's grab them and move on with our day. <laughs> I guess we could eat this and then we're at max energy for whatever else we end up doing today. And then there were seeds over here that I wanted. Hello, Elliot. A clam. Okay. Yes, thank you, Broccoli. Willy, hello. I brought you the chubs. Ah, you succeeded. The chub is an exciting catch. They're always hiding in the most peculiar places. Here's your reward. He just throws it on the floor. Like, we'll take care of that in a second. We got a couple things we can sell you. Thanks for helping lighten my inventory. We're we just gonna leave that muscle over there? I think we are. I don't think I have a real need to go do anything with that, but we are gonna go straight here into the mayor's house, grab whatever this is. All right, with two more tickets, we can get another another drink thing, another whatever that is, super friendship item. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Gus, are you ready for business? Oh, excellent. Uh, thanks for the pizza. Have a great day. Now we just have to find Sam, who was not on the beach. So I'm hoping that he is in his house. This morning I accidentally stepped on a bug. Oh no. Did it squish? I don't see you in your room. I don't see you in your house. Are you with Joja? Where else could you be? It's the only place I can think of. Over here? On the left? No? Okay. Let's go try Joja then. To Joja! Oh, Sam. I have pizza. Are you here? Jody's here. Pam's here. Shane's here. They're perfect. Oh, pizza time, please be three. Yes! Okay. Now. How do I get the event? I'm not sure, but we can do research between episodes. <laughs> ah, three hearts. I think three hearts is all we need. I think that's the exact amount. Perfect. Our speed boost should be wearing off any time now. I don't think that espresso speed got any buffs, so it'll be going away here in just a minute. Oh, right now that the green rain has come and gone, we can freely chop down as many trees as we want. And we just leveled up foraging. Well, that's nice. Well, that's a good bonus right there. You know what else would be a good bonus? Having a golden pickaxe. That would be amazing. Do we have one? No, we only have a nice little iron one. Steel, whatever it's called. Which I suppose is better than having, you know, the beginning one. Which it's ten chops. I think this is six now. It's gotten slightly better. Four, five, six. Yeah, it's six now. Iridium, though, two more upgrades is half that. It's three. It's one, two, boop, boop, that's it. That is a lot of bushes over there. And I did not bring anything to deal with that. So I think we're probably just going to leave that alone. I have no need to disturb it. We'll chop down as many trees as we can have time and energy for, however. So I will need as much wood as possible. Lots of projects that we need to get done. 
Like what, you may ask? Well, let me tell you. We need wood for tappers. We need wood for the barn upgrade. We need wood for some more chests. We need wood for some pathing, potentially. Maybe even some fences. Um, what else might we need wood for? A house upgrade? Is that wood or is that? That might, that might just be hardwood. Uh, okay. I think maybe we'll leave that tree alone because I don't have a spot for a seed. I need mm, that one too. I need to go and sell this uh, pesky extra glow ring we have actually. Maybe we should do that and chop down some trees like up by the spa maybe? We could put a bunch of this stuff away and get on up there and clear some of that out. Oh, that's not a bad idea. We do have these mountain warp totems. Not that I need one right now because we have the mine car. Like once you get the mine car, I, I really don't know how useful the, the mine, like the mountain warp is then. Because you're never really that far from one of the minecar entrances. So like, I don't know. The mountain warp to me is the least, the least useful placement of a warp. I, I kind of wish it was up by the train. Like if I could warp straight to the spa, like right by the spa, now that would be tempting. It really would be, but, you know, short of that, eh, eh, I don't know. I'm just not that excited about it, I guess. Oh, there's a seed right there, but we don't have any room in the old inventory. You know what else? We don't have energy. Yeah, we don't have a lot of energy either. Okay, quick stack whatever we can quick stack here. This needs to go there. Uh, where do we put the mountain warps at? Is it? I don't know. I know we have another one somewhere. Two in a row. We can sell this. We can sell that. We can put the mystery box back in there. You know, we do have this rare crow. That's pretty nice. I'll just toss it there for now. Not that that's where it's going to live, but... We will certainly put it there. Sell all of that. So I guess... I guess we just put the warp there then, I suppose. I don't know where else to put it. Okay. Drop, drop that off. Let's grab the sword and the pickaxe. Go back over to summer here, and we're going to grab... Two squash. I don't think we need both. We're just going to grab one, maybe. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to be able to... How much energy we're going to be able to burn off, honestly, before the uh, the end of the day. So let's... Let's just kind of hold off on having another one. We did get almost 450 wood there, by the way. I, in, just in case you weren't paying attention. Which, I mean, why would you have been? <laughs> paying attention to that exact number, but it was like 447, something like that. I don't need a new sword, but I don't need this glow ring either. What do you have for sale, by the way? What do we got? 28 to 46. I wish it told you the stats in there. Yeah, see? It's it's close. That one has more speed. How are we doing, by the way? What about dust sprites? Where are we at? Oh, 121 out of 500. That's a ways to go. That, that's a ways to go. Okay, do we work on gold or iron? Um, I think maybe we work on iron. Yeah, let's work on iron first. We can also thereby work on maybe finding some more dust sprites. It's like a win-win, really. Unless, of course, the game gives us zero iron nodes, in which case... We have worked on nothing. Oh, there's there's a couple. Okay. 
always nice to find what you're actually looking for. Yes, indeed. Oh, there's bats coming. Maybe one of them will turn into a staircase for us. Anything there? No. Cheap, 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 cheap. Oh, yes. How many times can we find the same dwarf scroll in one playthrough, you may ask? Well, I think we're up to five. I think we found the green one five times now. Which is kind of a silly number. Usually you're looking around for them, you know, and the game right now is just throwing this green one at us repeatedly. Saying, are you not entertained? Do you not love the green scroll? And I'm like, you know, I have to admit, I like the green scroll about one time of finding it worth. And then I really don't care about it anymore. That's how I feel. Okay, dust sprites. Okay, I, I hear you. I hear you calling for attention. I hear you. Yes. Uh, I don't even know how many more this is. It was several. Somebody mentioned to me the other day in a comment also that uh, broken glasses and CDs are really good sources of refined quartz. And that is true if you can be bothered to set up a, re a recycling machine. And I say that deliberately because I, I'm pretty sure one of the community center rewards is a recycling center, it, like, like machine. So I just... I'm so loath to build them when I'm pretty sure that you should just get one for the community center at some point. I would love one more iron game. Okay, just just one more one more one more ore. Like not a whole node, okay? Just just literally like one piece falling out of a rock would be great. I don't think it Oh, there it is. Look at that. Thank you, game. Now we have 20 right on the nose. Back to the bus stop. Do we have coal? Uh, I think we got some. Yeah, we have coal as well. The perfect amount. Hello, possum. Hey, buddy. Hi there. Man, that thing is freaky looking. It's just kind of creepy looking, isn't it? I'm not a fan. Right. Put that away. Put those away. Stack everything there. Do I need this? Nope, sure don't. Just to double check. And it says an artifact. Yeah, okay, we already knew that. Great. Time for sleep. Ah, uh, go to sleep, yes. <gasps> Foraging level that ooh, now we can make tree fertilizer. We can also make wild seeds for winter. We're like a whole season ahead now. And we even made some money. Oh, look at those pile of peppers. So if you uh, pick a pick of peppers, you too can make a little bit of money from them. Uh, not a lot of money. It's mostly by volume. But hey, that's okay. It's all good. Ding! Well, there you have it, friends. I'm going to take a minute to go look up that event with Sam and see how to trigger it now that we're at three hearts. I think we just have to go to the beach, but we'll see. And uh, otherwise, have a great day. Thanks again, as always, for your support. We'll see you in the next episode. Take care, everybody.